Hi, my name is Rod Kite, and I'm an attorney who represents businesses in the cannabis industry. Today I'm going to be talking about cannabidiol, commonly known as CBD, and specifically the circumstances in which it is lawful. I'm going to be talking about two aspects of the legal status of CBD. One aspect is its controlled status. In other words, under what circumstances is it an illegal compound versus a lawful compound? And secondly, I'm going to be talking about the way that the FDA views it under the Food, Drug, and Cosmetic Act. So first, let's talk about its controlled substance uh, status. CBD is a controlled substance when it's derived from marijuana. On the other hand, when it's derived from hemp, it's not controlled and it is a lawful compound. This is because on December 20th, 2018, Congress enacted the Agricultural Improvement Act of 2018, commonly known as the 2018 Farm Bill. And in the 2018 Farm Bill, Congress created a definition for hemp, which is the cannabis sativa L plant containing concentrations of Delta 9 THC of no more than 0.3% on a dry weight basis. And because of that law and the fact that in the law it described all parts of the plant as being lawful and specifically included cannabinoids among all plants, CBD is lawful and not a controlled substance under the Controlled Substances Act when it's derived from hemp. Hemp and CBD are legal throughout the country pursuant to the 2018 Farm Act. You may have heard that Congress will create certain regulations about growing and regulating hemp. As of this date, uh, it's February the 23rd of 2019, Congress has not enacted those regulations. It may be three, six, or even 12 months before we see full regulations. Additionally, states have an opportunity to opt out of the federal, federal regulatory scheme if they propose regulations that are approved by the USDA. As of today's date, no state plans have yet been approved, but we can anticipate that certain plans will be approved. No matter what, we know that CBD from hemp will be lawful throughout the country. It's only how it's regulated that may differ from state to state. That takes us to the FDA's position on CBD. You may have heard or be aware of the fact that this FDA takes the position that CBD cannot be used as an article or an ingredient in food, also that it cannot be marketed as a dietary supplement, and that no drug or medical claims can be made about it. And that's based on an investigative new drug called Epidiolex the FDA approved last summer in 2018. Important to my clients, such as Earthly Body, who manufacture topical and cosmetic products, these FDA positions on the Food, Drug, and Cosmetic Act with respect to CBD do not apply to topical and cosmetic products. In other words, so long as these products are not marketed as dietary supplements, which would be kind of strange because you don't eat topical um, medica or topical products. And um, as long as no health or medical claims are made about them, then topical products can use CBD isolate derived from hemp. Thank you so much.